Once again, I'm your host, KB Tindall. We are chilling out at the Hip Hop Sunday Brunch Concept, the Rodriguez Show. This is RCRD weekend. This is the inaugural weekend of a three-day weekend event. And right now, I'm chilling with the boy, Flaquito Bang. What's going on, baby? What's up, man? How's it going? All right, good, man. Good, good. Yo, um, give me a little bit of your history as far as how you got into music and also where you rep from. Okay, so uh, basically, how I got into music was, uh, am I supposed to hold this? I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, basically, how I got into music was, <clears throat> excuse me, when you first learned how to write and they was like teaching you like rhyming sounds and stuff, I, I think what happened was I just like immediately took to that. And uh, like my, my favorite books growing up was Cat in the Hat, like all them Dr. Seuss, all them, I had like every Dr. Seuss book, like, you know what I'm saying? And um, from there on, I just like started experimenting with writing. Um, I love the art form of writing. And I, I, I guess that just blossomed into music for me. Uh, Cause it's that, it, I think it's the most fun and creative way of expressing yourself. You know, I'm, as a writer, um, I'm not I'm not that great as a, like a, I can't write a novel. I, I've tried to write like two different novels, I didn't really work out. And so like the thing that really clicked was like, you know, song formats and, and like patterning, you know, different, like my cadence and like getting all that kind of stuff right. So uh, that that's that. And um, I'm actually from Illinois. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not a California native, but I, I've been out here for almost 15 years. Um, I, got, I got four little ones out here, two boys, two girls, just like that in that order. Um, you know, I got a wife out here, man. So it's like, I, I, Cali's really grown on me, you know what I mean? And uh, I'll probably, I, I always tell my family, because my family done moved since, I moved out here my senior year in high school with my, with my whole family, and uh, they done moved to Arizona, my, my older brother live in Atlanta now, and I was like, man, I, I told them I'll probably die in, in uh, Cali, you feel me? <laughs> I hear you, man. Ain't nothing to be mad at about Cali, man. Absolutely not, man. Um, what, what joints did you perform out there on, on a stage today? I did about five tracks today. Um, I got a song, a lot of this stuff, except for the very last one, all of it is on my SoundCloud, by the way. Flakito Bang, F-L-A-K-I-T-O-B-A-N-G. Um, but the first song I did was called Money Is The Only Thing That Matters. And that's just basically about people having a mindset like, Money is the only thing that matters. I was just kind of trying to contrast that and uh, let them know that it's not just about that. Right, right, um, right. I think the second song I did was No Problem. That's an original beat. Shout out to the homie Screech. I am Screech who produced that. Um, and that was dope. It's just an ag aggressive, like, uh, self-announcing style track, you know. Uh, what was my next one? Uh, I'm Ready. I'm Ready and All On Me. The next two that followed those first two are like a... It's like a cross between like rap. I'm doing a little bit of m melody, like kind of harmonizing or singing okay. in there. Right, right. Um, but it's like they're still rap. I, they're, I, they're what I'll call like my club style turn up tracks. Okay. And then my last song I did was Never Fold. That's an unreleased track. I've been getting a lot of positive uh, feedback from that. Um, I'm really excited about that song. It's, it's going to be that one itself is going to be on my uh, debut project that I'm working on should be released either at the end of this year or sometime soon next year. Okay, do you got you got a name for the uh, for the project for the debut project? Um, I got I got several different names that I'm kicking around. Okay, so you so, so yeah. still, you still it's still marinating. I have yeah. I have a total of like five different names. Okay, that are it's gonna be they're all gonna be projects. I just don't know which ones I'm gonna do first. Right. How I'm gonna which how how I'm gonna theme it out. So like I've been, I'm I'm actually playing like three different tape ideas I'm kicking around ideas for so okay yeah all right that's dope um so so coming from Illinois and, and then coming to uh, Santa Ana California you know which is you know like the home of the observatory and, and you know places where a lot of major artists come and perform and, and a weekend like this like RCRD weekend this is the inaugural weekend of a three-day event man um, how does it feel to be a part of an event like this and, and where do you see it going you know next year when it comes back Man, it's amazing. I, you know, I, I couldn't say thank you enough to everybody here. His one on one radio, the Rodriguez Show, um, for, for hosting this particular event today. Um, we also got uh, Slap Station Visuals. Uh, we got RCRD hosting the whole thing. We got Concept Projects hosting the whole thing. You know, there's a lot of people who came, uh, Trunk Base, um, even, even bringing you guys out here. You know, there's a lot of people who are involved with this. It's, it's so big. And like I love I love the direction they're going, how they're trying to turn Orange County 
and the untapped market that's out here. Also, SoCal, the, the SoCal Radio, I forgot to shout them. Um, what they're trying to do is make it like, like how LA is, you feel me? Orange County is, like I said, an untapped market. There's tons of artists, tons of talent out here that people just haven't heard of, don't know about. Yeah. And what these people are doing is, is amazing. And I think it's only going to grow from here. Next year, it could only get back, bigger and better. Yeah. Absolutely. It's definitely definitely a marketplace that's untapped, and, and there's a lot of talent out here, man. You know what I mean? And, it, and it's good that, you know, outlets like us, like 10TV and other outlets that are out here supporting this weekend can bring all you artists together. You know what I mean? Where you guys can start to collaborate and network and get to know each other and find out what kind of other music is out there that you're feeling and, and vibe with these other artists, man. I think that's really great, man. Um, let everybody know where they can catch you and follow you on social media, man. Uh, you can find me on SoundCloud and Instagram, both at Flaquito Bang. That's F-L-A-K-I-T-O-B-A-N-G, all one word. SoundCloud and Instagram. And then if you want to find me on Snapchat or Twitter, you can find me at King Flock, K-I-N-G-F-L-A-K. Flaquito with a K. That's what it is. Flaquito Bang is in the building, man. This is 10TV, RCRD Weekend. It's a pleasure having you, my Thanks brother. Me, no yeah. doubt, man. Definitely. We out of here.